explain it real fixes real fast.com. You know, quite often on a GM vehicle, the door handle will break. Now, as you can see, we've already replaced this. It was broken, it wouldn't work. And this is what we took out. So you can buy these, and there's various styles. That's not the hard part. Oftentimes, for the do it yourselfer, the difficult thing is how to get this off, how to get the handle off. Now, for most of us in the trade, they make a simple little tool like this. It's designed to get the clip off. If you're wondering, there's a little clip back behind here, and you have to get that off before you can take the panel off to replace the handle. This tool is designed to be able to slip back here, catch that clip, and then pull your handle off. But sometimes it can be kind of difficult. Usually it'll work. But anyway, if this is the only time you're going to do this job and you don't want to buy this tool, here's a shortcut that works just as well. Here's a tool that I've found that's uh, very helpful when taking these uh, door handles off. Whenever you're doing this, take the flat edge of your rag and go towards where the handle is pointing because the clip always comes up from the bottom and is pointing towards the handle. That's your rag. Now what it's actually doing whenever you can't see it and it's on the door is this rag is dragging across here on the side of the clip and what happens is these little fibers in the rag catch the edge of that clip and it just pops it right out and when you're all done you just snap the clap clip back in there like it is and you just slide it back on the door there you go tools are nice but do it yourselfers are always asking us how can i do that without that special tool not that this is expensive but this sure is cheap.